When people apply for Medicaid coverage for long-term care in a nursing home, MassHealth requires they provide bank statements going back 60 months. That's five years, the look-back period that catches disqualifying transfers of money and property owned by the nursing home applicant or their spouse. The look-back period can even catch transfers made many years before, like this case from October 2015, where the Office of Medicaid had disqualified the February 2011 application for MassHealth by a nursing home resident who had transferred the family home to an irrevocable trust in the 1990s. I'm John Roberts, an elder law attorney for people in Hamden County, Massachusetts. In the application for Medicaid coverage for a nursing home, you'll also need to fill out a long-term care supplement that covers the look-back period and disqualifying transfers of income and assets over the past 60 months. Under the regulations, the five-year look-back period begins on the first day the individual is both in a nursing facility and has applied for benefits. The regulations allow single people an eligibility ceiling of $2,000 in countable assets. If the applicant has given anything away during the five years before they apply, they can get disqualified. In this case, the nursing home resident had a trust valued at $412,000. MassHealth decided to count the trust as an asset because of a provision in the trust. And that $412,000 trust put the applicant way over the $2,000 ceiling. So attorneys for the nursing home resident went to probate court in 2012, where a probate judge reformed the trust. The nursing home resident contended that MassHealth was then required to consider the reformed trust, and that state regulations governing disqualifying transfers during the look-back period would not apply. But the appeals court disagreed. The reformation of the trust was itself a disqualifying transfer of assets. The nursing home resident's trust reformation constituted a disqualifying event, and federal law requires the transfers within the look-back period face a period of ineligibility. So there are many things a Medicaid applicant cannot do during the five years leading up to the nursing home admission, including other probate procedures like disclaiming an asset from an estate, Mass Health may consider as a disqualifying transfer any action taken to avoid receiving a resource to which the nursing facility resident or spouse is or would be entitled to if such action had not been taken. But there are other regulations that do allow transfers during the look back period to people who do not cause disqualification.